um, some of my responsibilities are the shuttle arm and the station robotic arm and uh, load master for all the transfer um, and on entry I'll be sitting on the flight deck helping with our entry duties. Our other spacewalker Rick Mastracchio are going to be exiting the station for him to do their spacewalk. And the, okay, these are all great guesses. First of all for Earth, what's this over here on this side? Okay, that's the Earth. Okay. So that can't be the Earth, that's the Earth. It could be the moon, it's very far away, but guess what that is? That is a satellite and it's a very special satellite. It is our International Space Station. Okay, at that point, he's going to, well, I think we left it open. Um, he's going to open up one of the lockers and it's just going to be a clothing locker and it's going to have the restraints here so I can explain to the kids <clears throat> that everything has to be held down because otherwise we'd have a problem with things floating away. Oh, I learned so much from Krista. A uh, couple things is I learned, or it, and it's a lesson that I still have to keep reminding myself, but to uh, pay attention to what's important and let the other things go, not worry so much about things. And to Krista, what was most important to her were people and their dignity and her students. And um, one of the things that I carry in my heart um, for and will forever is that even when Krista was in quarantine down at the Kennedy Space Center, uh, the day before launch, she was still doing the work of a teacher and she was writing letters of recommendation for some of her students. Uh, Ron McNair, and, uh, pilot Mike Smith, followed by Krista Masala, teacher in space. Challenger, go with throttle up. Challenger, go with throttle up. One minute, 15 seconds, velocity 2,900 feet per second, altitude 9 nautical miles, downrange distance 7 nautical miles. And some of the things that we'll be doing on um, orbit, we want our young people to uh, be thinking about, look deep inside, not look at us, but look deep inside, and what is it that they're curious about? What do they want to know about space flight? What do they want to know about exploration? What do they want to know about maybe the possibilities for their future? Hello, hello. Me too. Look at that. Thank you.